Hey, Scorpio family, let's dive into this energy. Uh, yeah, I'm having a wonderful day because I am. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I hope y'all have a reason to smile. I hope, I pray that everything is going in your favor because, ooh, what is this that was turned over? Ooh, alien, telepathic, dreams, songs. Ooh, okay, I'm not gonna take it, but if it pop back out, you know we already saw it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, Most High, what is coming into fruition? Spirit is saying that your dreams have been coming very vivid, family. Spirit says, hey, for some of you guys that do, that are dreamers, uh, start writing down your dreams. When you fall asleep or right before you fall asleep, make a subconscious decision to remember your dreams. And when you wake up, write them down. Put Have a tablet by your bed. Spirit says your dreams are about to start revealing a lot of things. A lot of you guys are, are very much prophets and you have a lot of a telepathic and um, telepathic gifts. Spirit says the messages that you really need to hear that's going to define your um your next step is are give are given to you in your dream. So start uh practicing those gifts that you have. All right, messages clear and true. What's coming in from my spot feels? All right, first thing we have is coming together and <laughs> single. Well, single is kind of first, so single coming together, whatever. I feel like right now they coming together first. Okay, so I see right now there's somebody that you could be uh kind of reconcile, reconciling with or someone that wants to reconcile. Uh, a spiritual union contract is on hand. I feel like you've been manifesting a lover because, you know, seeing that last ride, that last reading I did, I guess a lot of y'all Scorpios need some sexual healing. So you are really calling in a connection, not just for that. That's part of it, but not just for that, but for actually just the union. For some of you guys, you haven't been in a relationship in a while. Some are just not getting in a relationship. And for those who are already in a relationship, um, I, how, how y'all doing? Cause, cause you know, I know before this, you was, you was by yourself for a while. You know, it get kind of hard to break in. Well, maybe not. Maybe you good. But how's it going? It's going good. You, you been wanting to, you know, be by yourself yet? Oh no, we, I'm gonna get to the read. I was just asking a question for y'all who already in it because y'all already there, you know. Some people, you know, timelines be. Anyway, but yeah. So coming together, I see this family. Um, I do see it's gonna be a very, uh, it feels like an enduring uh, situation. And then I see current status is available. So what this makes me feel like is maybe there's somebody that wants to come in and could be trying to put the pressure on you to be in a relationship with them. Cause if it's reconciling, it's like, you have to see if you want to deal with a person again. And if it's a spiritual union, then it's like, maybe you're on the, on uh, like, like maybe you met somebody that you really like and you're trying to see, dang it, is this, I know we got a spiritual connection, but the last one I was in, you know, it was a connection, but it wasn't a good one. We went, hello, can you hear me now? Can you hear me out looking ass? So with the soul contract, I feel like um, family is kind of like meeting somebody and trying to see where is it gonna go. And then also for, for Scorpios, I feel like it, it, it's the energy of, uh, kind of seeing like, well, I don't want to really rush into nothing, but I feel a connection. Let's just see where it goes. So it's kind of like, um, feeling something, but dumbing down the connection so that it could, so you could still be in the energy of being free. It's like just trying to see how strong the connection is if you want to give that an opportunity. Because I feel like, Scorpio, some of you guys going into this next level, I feel like you're going to be at a level platform where you just ain't going to be able to just drop, jump into a relationship with anybody. I feel like you're going to date. Yeah, I do. I feel like, and, and not just that, but you're going to date and be honest. Like, well, yeah, I am talking to this person, but we're trying to see where it goes, you know, if that's okay with you or if you feel like you're comfortable with handling that. I feel like, Scorpio, you're going to say some play-ass shit because you're like, shit, I'm at this plateau. I got I gotta feel energies. I just, I just don't know what I want. You feel me? Like, but you deserve it. You deserve it because you need to make sure. Oh shit! I see this divine masculine. See, mm-hmm. Yep. See, somebody's divine masculine is coming in. Somebody, whoever's a divine masculine in this, in this uh, Scorpio, I feel like, um, mm-hmm. I feel like it's gonna. It's like a. A two-way situation. 
is somebody coming together want to reconcile and and this could be the 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 contract that you have cut off with a twin flame or toxic twin flame which they had they reneged their obligations to be in a part of the best duo superhero team in the universe and then you know this person trying to reconcile that they did they, they don't want to be great no more and then i feel like you're in a single energy scorpio and then here comes your masculine or your divine feminine your new upgrade is coming in you got to be like oh um, you know, I mean, we already been there, done that. You feel me? You wasn't, you wasn't ready. Now you got divine masculine showing this beautiful as a divine feminine up here, just being just as beautiful and great as she could be, or he, whatever the energy. I feel like you, you in a place of con contemplation. No, not really. Let, let me. Sorry, Scorpios. I know. Uh, wishing, hoping praying, yearning. Yeah, so I feel like you have somebody here that from the past that's wishing, hoping, and praying. Wishing on the start that they're going to be able to come back in. I'm taking them back. Okay. And, um, you know, to a connection, but I feel like that's over. And then with the single life, projected future days, weeks, months, spirit says for those who are single, y'all going to be in a connection in the future in some days and weeks, some months. I'm pulling towards weeks, so I feel like a lot of y'all about to be in connection because y'all been single for a while. You've been single for a long time. And Spirit is saying, ooh, 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 happy guys, okay? Then, and so uh, Spirit says you're projected to be in a relationship or... <coughs> Cause I'm seeing single, but spirit is saying you're going to be in a relationship for those who are single. And I feel like a couple of days or weeks, I mean, it do have months on here, but I'm only seeing the days and weeks. <laughs> like I have to look back like, is that month? I know it's same month, but I don't see it. And then right now with this divine masculine here, the next thing we have here is ascension, spiritual path awakening. So I feel like either some of y'all divine masculines is about to come and, and have a divine awakening or your new or there's a new divine masculine because the uh the connection is coming in that's going to be a higher level uh, like i feel like it's a it's, it's a more discipline uh more spiritual discipline and uh uh like earthly focus divine masculine that's coming in scorpio to come uh you know, it's like your know, divine masculine upgrade. Like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like for, for my Scorpio man, the divine feminine is, is going to be such an upgrade to uh, now your now karmic. <laughs> We ain't gonna call the uh, divine. I mean, yo, 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 uh, twin flame, because you know that that what what was that to do but to bring you to this this better version of what you deserve? So yeah, I feel. I feel like Scorpios, there's a there's an interesting combination coming in. But spirit, let me go ahead and look at some more. <laughs> there's an energy of this person in the past gonna be trying to bargain with you. And I got this in like probably uh I think it was like two days ago. It was more like somebody trying to get you to they trying to negotiate you. Like, did you can't negotiate this energy? You you look, this is this is how vibrations look. If you ain't got it, you ain't got it. Don't be a window shopper. You feel me? Don't. You, you, nah, nah. You know, negotiation. The price is the price. If just you can't, if you can't reach love, just say that. <laughs> if you can't get it, just say that. Okay, man. Okay, I'm just saying for real. Most time, what is this? This person wishing and hoping and praying that you're going to let them negotiate with you. I can't. This is funny. Yeah, they coming in hella fast. See, look, they trying to bargain your love. They trying to bargain your love. My love is not for sale, bro. Sis, no, you can't. No. They, they, and they was running. He was, he trying to get to you, honey. He trying to get to you. I see here with this uh, single TikTok uh, deadline time running out. And the thing is, that's the reason why this person is running to you. They trying to hear up and bargain. But the thing is, you're not going to be single for long. And that's why they're rushing in. Oh, my God. I It was a message that was given uh, a couple of days ago, basically, saying that there's somebody's... Uh, karmic or divine uh, or, or twin twin flame or whatever it is trying to rush in and um and uh oh man why can't i 
It's just trying to rush in because because they've been getting readings on on the divine feminine or the divine masculine, and 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 it's like the, the whatever the reading said was that a new love is coming in and they're about to be happy, married, pregnant, and this is what is pushing this. Uh, now karmic situation to rushing in trying to stop something that's why it kept having a hold or um it, it, it'll say like a pause this person is trying to stop a connection from coming for you because spirit already said for those who are single that time is limited you going from this to this spirit says that time is limited and it's projected within like i said all i see is days and weeks i didn't even notice the months here until i looked three times you know that's my number oh no those to this and then right now spirit says deadline it's the the, the time is up look at how the colors switch from dark to light from an age of not knowing certain type of information dark age to light new age Oh, Scorpio, spirits say you are about to get real colorful and not in that colorful money shit, not in the fake way, not, not appearing to be valuable, but being fucking valuable. Mm. Spirit, if you don't go ahead and give me this message to get to the collective, go ahead, give me this message, okay? Wait, we ain't done yet. Hold on, Scorpio, I ain't done with you yet. Most high, what is, what is this? Tick, look at this, tick, talk, tick, talk. Don't look like that's why he rushed it, look. Tick, talk, tick, talk. Oh, I gotta go get him, gotta go get Scorpio. Where he at, where he at? <laughs> <laughs> And then we got here shit. It's because Scorpios, you already know your time is in here. For you, for those who want to, to be in new relationships, for those who want to be multi-million billionaires, for those who want to have successful businesses and never want for nothing, for those who want to have children, for those who want to for those who want to be the light and really be who you know you are designed to be. You know that the time is now. You know, why is it that all this projected timing, time is everything. Spirit said it was the perfect time. That very thing you've been waiting on, that very thing that you have been patiently waiting for, consistently working on. Spirit says, you know it's in a matter of time. That's why you don't even feel no pressure because you know it's coming. Spirit says, you know it already, baby. You are going into a higher commitment, a higher level. You are ascending. This is your ascension. You going up. All the way up. You know it, Scorpio. And the thing is, the reason why everybody tripping and shit, because they know it too. Mm-hmm. They know it. And you know what? They're crushed. Spirit, Spirit, I love you. These people are crushed. They sad, broken, feeling alone now. Because you're no longer dealing with them but you are elevating to something greater. See, they should have kept you when you didn't even know who you was because you know your worth now. And you you know you worth the, you are irreplaceable. And now you got people who worth more than what you thought you were both then, knowing your worth now, knowing that it's greater than what they have. And they may have the world. It don't even matter because it's yours. Everything belongs to you, Scorpio. And they're crushed because they can't not experience this new level with you. They, it was at that moment they knew. They fucked up. <laughs> they didn't think you was going to make it, baby. Let alone the level you was going to be on. Oh, wait. I know they're going to be kicking their ass. Look, I keep having visions. Look, let me tell you before I get this next energy. So, I be having visions and dreams. Like, it's going to be certain situations where, like, the, the people who's rocking with you, they going to be looking old and, you know, all regular shit, you know, because we're going to be up here for some years, some hundreds of years. Anyway, so I feel like they grandkids, they great grandkids going to be like, man, like, they're going to be telling their story. Yeah, you know, I used to, I used to talk to Scorpio, you know, yeah. The ruler of all yesterday, the ruler of all. And you was like, man, Grandpa, you ain't never talked to no Scorpio. 
No, no, really, really. Until they had, you know, visual 3D images. I mean, we had the regular pictures. They're gonna be like, hell no, nah, granddaddy. How you, how you fuck that up? They're gonna be like, mom, you ain't, you mom, you ain't. Yeah, I did. In, in 2021. <laughs> They gonna be telling stories why they knew of you, man. Yeah, right. I'm telling you, generation after generation, they go, they go really hey, They fucked up you. This is this is gonna be. This is deeply. This is gonna be generationally rooted. You feel me? They, <laughs> they gonna feel like it's like a generational curse that they, they they fucked up over Scorpio. Did you know they was gonna be ruling for these? Did you know they names in books and you is not even in a storyline? Oh, that's messed up. <laughs> no, it'll be the storyline. Be like, yeah, that was me. <laughs> Look at that wouldn't you. Okay, pineapples. Most high, what's this crush why I let my Scorpios go? I know they about tired of me right now. <laughs> oh, I know y'all ain't. I love you too. <laughs> Most high, what is this crush? I'm sad, broken, feeling alone. Mm. <laughs> Now they like, look, I should have made a move. I want to give to you now. The king, we got the king of cups and the six of pentacles right now because this person sees somebody else loving you and giving to you. They crush because now you're being loved the way you always desired. <sighs> and they wish they had a stepped up. And now you in not only a, a, a connection that is spiritually uh ascending ascended but you know you would a, a sexy ass divine partner like <laughs> golly this is this energy is heavenly but anyway scorpios i will let you go but just to recap for those who tried to skip <laughs> recap somebody from the past trying to come back in they come back in real fast they want to negotiate some shit they want to negotiate your love so they are speeding down i-10 going 110 and right now you were single but spirits say that you're projected to be in a relationship in the next in a couple of weeks in the days and weeks, and Spirit says time is of the essence. That's the reason why this, you know it too. That's the reason why this motherfucker from the past trying to rush in because they've been getting readings. They've been looking at your whole future path with what your energy is right now. And all the spirits collectively are saying Scorpio is abundant. Scorpio is going to rule all this shit. So if you don't get in right now, she, he, she, Scorpio has called in a very, 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 very good looking divine counterpart. And if you don't rush your black ass in, she, they gonna be gone. She, he, they, Scorpio collective gonna be gone. But she, but Scorpio don't want to fuck with you though. Like Scorpio, because some of you guys, you really do not want this person that's coming back in. It's like I don't know what are you here for. Like bitch showing up at your wedding, talking about they they want to. I want to object. Somebody object. Is how did he get in here? <laughs> But anyway, and then you got a love, a very, a very divine connection that is spiritually, uh, spiritually brought to you to ascend together. And this is somebody that uh, is a king of cups that is very given, very wealthy. I'm seeing the king of pentacles as well. So I just feel like this person is going to be able to uh, keep keep you emotionally satisfied as well as uh, financially grounded. And I feel like you are going to be able to. Uh, be a part of the collective dominating the spiritual manifesting the new reality world Iris Scorpio so let me just say you a big fucking bang and things changing <laughs> my family